Where is the storage room? Oh, it's this little room right here. Okay. Oh, boy. Oh, shit! Welcome, welcome. Uh, tonight, we're going to be playing The Stalked. Now, I have played the demo of this game. This was the game where you are, you are being stalked by your abusive boyfriend. And she ends up going to her grandpa's old house or something like that. And more creepy shit starts to happen because the neighbors are weird and the people in that neighborhood is weird and 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 everybody's weird you know but um we're about to give this game a try hopefully hopefully it's good this is the full game so don't know how long it is but who cares All right who cares very some some snacks sit back we hit that follow button and enjoy <clears throat> i had to break up with liam and I hope he takes it well. Yes, yes, yada yada. We know this. Liam's gonna come stalking your cheeks and we gotta run from him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She was hungry. Put that shit, put that shit there. Boom, bada bing, bada boom. Where's your food at? Open fridge. Organic food, yes sir. Should look like I don't know what that should look like. Who will be knocking on my door at this hour? Slim. Who's there? Hey, honey, can I come in? Oh, Liam. I told you it's over. So now, so no, you can't come in. Come on, you can't just leave me like that. I love you more than anything. It's over, Liam. Just go home. Open the door, Kate. No, I'm not opening the door. I don't love you anymore, Liam. You'll be mine again soon. Crazy, bro. Crazy. Sounds like he walked away. Thank God. Uh, who should be ready? Uh huh. Ate the food. A bad to call myself. Okay. Close these doors. What was that? Ah. Give me another chance, please. I will treat you well and do anything you want, I promise. Just one chance is all I ask. That can't be too much, can it? Yo, he got an arm, bro. Holy shit. And, yo, bro. The size of this rock from all the way down here? It's wild. <laughs> I forgot. I completely forgot when he pops up. Holy shit, that was good. That called me. Again. Try, motherfucker! Oh, yeah. You gotta call Grandpa. Mm-hmm. The OG. Hmm. Hello, Grandpa. I need your help. Hey, Kate, what's going on? Liam broke into my apartment and chased me. I barely got away. Now I'm in my car with nowhere to go. That's horrible. Are you okay? Did he hurt you or something? No. I got away before he could do something, but I'm terrified he will find me. Okay. I assume you're looking for a place to stay for a while. Yes. You can come live with me for as long as you need, huh? However, I'm going to be out on a business trip for one week. That's fine. It's still going to be safer than staying here. Can I go there right now? Yes. I'll send you the address. The key to my house is in the flower pot. Also, remember to keep the doors locked, and if you need to go outside, you can always check the peephole first. Okay, thanks again, Grandpa. You are a lifesaver. No problem. I hope all goes well, and don't hesitate to call me again. I make a good impression of old people, right? He look like uh, Mark Zuckerberg. about to say bro how you didn't <sighs> mm -hmm. too easy that was a close call thank god i made it out 
I wonder what would have happened if. No, never mind. We end up starting over. I have finally broken free from that toxic relationship. Toxic, 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 toxic. The Liam managed to follow me here. I'm getting too par paranoid now. Of course, it's not him. Probably just a neighbor. I don't think that's how you spell neighbor. But it is not wise to, to assume that he did not follow you because if he's a stalker and he's crazy and he did all this, did all that, he definitely followed. He said, she's flower pot. Wow, it's dark in here. No shit. Let's turn on some lights and find the bedroom, shall we? Sure thing. Uh, boom. Uh, no, hold on. How? Oh, you can unlock those just by... Okay, hold on. Hold on. Yeah, lock that bitch up. Okay, okay, okay. Lock that bitch up too. Lock, boom. Bada bing, bada boom. This game look good. I don't remember it being this nice. Maybe they updated the graphics or something. Anyway, what are we supposed to be doing? Turning on the lights and then find the bedroom. Okay. And locking these doors. Hey, whoa, what is that? Hello. I know where the bedroom's at. I just want to look around. Okay, on the bedroom. Right here. Where is that? You turn on all the lights in the house. Wow, I got an achievement for that. I like that. I like achievements. Find the bedroom. Go to sleep, shall we? Can we close the door? Lock this bitch up. Can't lock it, okay. Yeah, that ass is asleep. Damn, I finished my chief you. <laughs> Wow, I slept that long. You sure did. You sure did. It's the daytime. It's beautiful outside. Is Grandpa home already? Nah. That motherfucker said he was gone for a week. Nah, we're gonna look in the peephole. You use the peephole for the first time. Can I move around? There's nobody there. Ah, uh, you know what? We're going from the side. That's what we're doing. But we smart. We a smart bit. See? Just like the demo. There was nobody there. Let me close my door. Yeah, lock that shit up. Yeah. Check the door. I did. Oh. Here is near resident of this mansion. If I'm the previous owner of this mansion and you are the person I have been looking for. I hope to see you stick around around for a while. I'm sure we will get along just fine. I will be watching you. Watch me. This is strange to say the least. I need to get going to the store before it gets dark though. Let's be careful. Yes, sure thing. We gotta go to the store and then we come back, blah blah blah, yada yada. Yeah, on the mo, on the mo. Oh, excuse me. 
What's that? Some kind of paper? First off, mind your damn business. Wow, it's creepy. How similar she looks to me. Uh, Ashley missing since 5... Uh, 15 AI. <laughs> Please help us bring Ashley home. If you have any information, even the smallest detail, contact the police. Your assistance could make all the difference. Alright. S is that us? Whoa! Oh, hi there. Haven't seen you before. Are you new? Yes, I just moved in. Where do you live? I don't feel comfortable telling you that. Are you alone? Um, I'm in a hurry. Sorry, I gotta go. You creepy ass motherfucker. Buy grocery, okay? Uh, I mean... What... What do I buy? Give me a list. Give me a list, motherfucker. What do I buy? You there. Oh. Okay, never mind. Somebody's pulling up. I remember. That's all. Let's go pay. Hello. Hey, hello. Is that all? Yes. All right. The total is twenty-two fifty. Thank you for shopping here. Also, can I tell you? Can I? I can tell you are new to the area. How long are you staying for? No problem. I'm not sure yet. Not too long, I would assume. Damn. All right. Have a good day. And here are your groceries. Thanks. You too. I remember something. Yeah. You know, a young beautiful lady like you shouldn't be all uh, out all alone like this. What do you want? I do have some wishes, but I think it's best they remain unspoken. Be careful. Don't and don't let me catch you all alone again. Whoa, hold on. This motherfucker just I don't need your warnings. Respect my space and stay away. Don't let me catch you alone again? Bro, these people, these dudes are wild out here. You know these dudes don't get none. They don't get no buns. Let's not forget our groceries in the car, okay? Store groceries in the fridge. Lock that bitch up, uh-huh. All right, we're good. Let's kitchen again. Um, right here. Yes. That's it, right? Whoa, 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 what happened? What did I do wrong? Welcome home. Wait, wait. You look beautiful in the store today. Is that fucking creep that ran up on us? Can't wait to see you again. Yeah. Getting closer? Huh? Oh. I is he inside or outside? I'm soon there. Damn. Or what if I'm already there? Bro, grab a weapon or something. Who is this girl? She's not safe anywhere. You're a fucking queen of somewhere? I'm here. Check the door. Ain't nobody there neither. Nah, we're not doing that. Another piece of paper. Look, there is numerous congratulations on settling in. You may believe this mansion is your refuge, but every step you take reveals a deeper game. I'm with you in every choice, every move. There's no escape from becoming mine. 
This is getting out of hand. I need to drive away and call the police before it's too late. Drive away. Okay. Wild. Please start. Come on. Why now? All times. A little cold in my room. Uh, something's really wrong. I have to get inside and call the cops, like, right now. Yeah, use your phone. We can use the phone and call the police. That you have in your motherfucking hand. What is that? Is that press? There you go. Call the cops. Get in here. This is a perfect spot right here. Now, on, what's your emergency? Hi, hi, I need help. I've been receiving threatening messages, letters, and texts. I'm really scared. I'm here to help you. Can you please arrive at your location? I'm at. Blah, blah, blah. It's urgent. I understand. I'm dispatching officers to your location right now. Location right away. Can you describe the nature of the threats? They've been watching me, following me. The messages are getting more intense. Please hurry. Stay on the line with me. Help is on the way. In the meantime, try to find a safe place. A safe and secure location within your home and make sure you to lock your doors officers should be there soon okay thanks oh my doors are locked yeah that's locked that's locked yes they're locked please hurry help is on the way stay strong i'm with i'm here with you until the officers arrive some someone just need Someone just tried to open the door. Officers will be there any second now. I'm good here, right? <gasps> We're safe! I bet you, I bet you, that's not the real police. It appears that everything is under control now. Our officers apprehended a man in a white van outside your residence. We're bringing him in for questioning. If something else happens, don't hesitate to call us. Take care. Thank you for your help. I'll be sure to reach out if something else happens. You lying, bro. Phew, what a relief. I never thought I'd feel safe again, but maybe some, maybe things can get back to normal now. It should be safe now. Let's head to the basement outside and restore the power. Ah. Okay. Just like that? The basement was somewhere around here. Yeah, I remember. I remember. I remember some weird shit as well was down here. A flashlight right here. Oh. The power should be back on now. Yeah. E. Okay. Back inside. I stink of sweat. Let's take a bath before I go to sleep. Okay. Bath it is. Lock that bitch up too. You can't lock it. Okay. Moment of peace. But why would that stranger go so far from me? Whatever, whatever. It's over now. It's a good question. Why? How? The door is closed. I'm so exhausted that I'm hearing things now. Let's just go to bed. Yeah, for real. If, how the fuck is he going to take a picture? Unless he opened it, took a picture, and then closed it right away. That'll make no sense, though. Is there like a... Is there like a little space? little hole? 
go to bed. Let's go to bed. No, turn that shit on. Ah. You know, we should be able to lock this door. Right. I feel like this can open. Or oh, there's like a like a room behind those shelves. Those bookshelves. Maybe the grandpa has enemies. What is that noise? Sounds like it's coming from the storage room. Where is the storage room? Oh, it's this little room right here. Okay. Oh, boy. Oh, shit! I think I fought it too. Oh shit. Oh my Ooh, I should probably I should probably call to check how Liam is doing. I mean the reason all this is happening to begin with is because I broke up with him. It's all my fault. If I had just stayed with Liam, he would have kept me safe. I if I knew the reason behind as to why she broke up with him. Then I can make a, a a right decision. I mean, you broke up with him, right? Uh, what should we go? What should we choose? I'm not a very forgiving person, so maybe he did something wrong, and he deserved not to have her, so. No, of course not. What am I thinking? Let's put my mind on something else. But first, let's make sure the house is empty. I still don't feel safe. I should have known that shit was a dream, bro. That shit scared the fort out of me. Something looks off about that book. The, yeah, yeah, of course. It's the only one that stands out. They all look, they're all the same except for this one. You found a hidden room. Oh, shit. Grandpa. What is Grandpa doing? I feel, if, ever since ever since the demo, I've always, want, I've always been suspicious of Grandpa. Why would you want to leave me? I have done nothing but good to you. Whatever, it doesn't matter anymore. You are never leaving me again. Can't close that. What the fuck? Uh, a sudden disappearance. Ashley's whereabouts unknown. 27 year old Ashley was reported missing on August 15, 2013, by her husband. Two days after she disappeared from their home, last seen in their, in their residence, Ashley's sudden absence has raised suspicions with her husband emerging as a prime person of interest in the ongoing investigation while authorities continue to search for leads they urge anyone with information to come forward and assist in the search for ashley where she was last seen oh they think she's ashley probably look honey we made the news pretty cool right it's locked oh it's more papers here I can't replace you, Ashley. There's no one that is special as you, okay? Why did you force me to do this? I never wanted to harm you, okay? My fault. How is it my fault? How is it my fault? I didn't want it to end like this. You left me with no other option. What the fuck did I do? How am I gonna live on without you? What is the point of all this? I'm typing to a dead person. I would do anything to get you back. Uh, am I dreaming? I swear that that is you. She looks just like you. Have you come back to me 10 years later? She is just as beautiful as you were. She has to become mine. She will, no matter what. I can't let her run away from me like you once did. Ah, it's probably about time I talk to Grandpa about what's going on here. This is crazy. Look behind you, though. Turn around! Shit about the game bop behind her head grandpa are you there yes has something happened a lot has happened 
a lot, a lot has been happening since happening. I've received creepy letters and been followed by someone I don't think is Liam. I called the police and they arrested a suspicious individual lurking around the house. But when I thought it was all over, I found a strange hidden room in your house that contains some psychotic things to say the least. What? This is insane. Maybe the police arrested the guy leaving the letters in a hidden room. I've lived there for 10 years and never seen that. I'll be cutting this business trip short and coming home ASAP. I can't stand not being able to help you. I like to think they arrested him, but what if they didn't? What if he's still out there? What if they arrested someone who got set up? He make It makes me so uneasy just thinking about it. What do you remember about the person you brought this place, you bought this place from? That could definitely be the case. I remember that his wife had recently gone missing without a trace. It was the talk of the town for quite a while. And his name was... Are you serious? My, my phone ran out of battery and I didn't have time to bring my charger with me. Man, you stupid. You gotta charge your phone. Let's go find a flashlight in case I need... Oh, we gotta go downstairs for the fucking flashlight. Oh, shit. Yeah. Keep that door locked though. All right, so now we know it's definitely the previous house owner stalking her because she looks like his dead wife, ex-wife. Sir. Oh! Oh. All right, we're back inside. I should search for a weapon just in case. Let's start by looking through Grandpa's office. Grandpa's office, huh? Upstairs. Is this Grandpa's office? Yeah, pretty sure. What's this? Chips. Grandpa be munching. A key. Grab that. There is nothing in use here. What is this key for right here? Oh, you motherfucker. Yeah, what? Is... That has to be Grandpa, right? Check the door. There's no way that Grandpa got, got here so fucking fast. You lying. Hi, sorry if I scared you. I just had to. I just complain about something. Of course you did. You are the creep. You are the creep that talked to me earlier outside the convenience store. What do you want to complain about? I know it was creepy, but it was my idea. Liam told me to do it in hopes that you would take him back to feel safe again. I was supposed to take it a step further now, but I couldn't do it. I felt too sorry for you. It all makes a lot of. It all makes a lot more sense now. Thank you for telling me. I still don't feel safe around you. Can you leave me? Can you leave now, please? Yes, of course. I'm sorry again. All right, so he's not the creep. Okay, he left. All right. It's locked. Really? It's night already? That's crazy. It's not already. How? Go to bed. Go to bed. Huh? Did that come from the bedroom door? No way. Impossible. You thought this was over? You feel helpless now? Don't you? Your car doesn't work. Your phone is dead. The police think they got the person behind this and you don't know where I am. There is nothing that can stop me anymore. Well, what do I do? I know if I follow down the other path I saw when I first got here, maybe I can find some neighbors that can help me. Follow other path. Oh no, I'm out of here. Follow the other path. Bro, just keep running. Just get the fuck out of there. Call your grandpa later. He's following me!
This is the path, right? This one. I think so. Oh, did I fuck up? Uh, where's the path now? Oh my god, I don't know where I'm going now. I think it's this one. I think, I think. Look at the car right here. Look at the car right here. This is definitely Liam's car. Liam is doing all this. Hell to the fucking no. Get your ass out of there, bro. Oh boy. Don't tell me you go don't tell me we need to go down there. We're not going down there. We're about to get smoked if we go down there. Right, I'm gonna go down this way. Let's see what happens. If the game lets me. Oh no, it doesn't. Yes, go down here. Somebody's not. That's Liam. That, that's Liam. What happened to you? Why was why would someone do this to you? She is mine. And only mine. Damn, Liam. Maybe we should have called him. Oh shit. Let's shift to sprint. I've been doing that the whole fucking game. Wait, somebody behind me? The door. The trap door. I think there are Ash these are Ashley's remains. What a sick and twisted individual her husband is. I don't even want to know what he will do to me. Damn. Sick bastard. Uh, we can't go up here. We gotta get out of here. The cashier. Hey, I wouldn't want anyone. I couldn't wait anymore. I need you now, my new Ashley. Wow, it was a cashier. Get shit out of me. So I, no. So it it was you who has been sending the letters. I know I look similar to your ex-wife, but that doesn't mean I can replace her. I don't care. How you look is more than enough. Come here. I have been waiting so long for this. No, no, no. I have to run before it's too late. Damn. Liam, no. I'm sorry, Liam. Run. Run. Oh, shit. How are we going to... Oh. Oh, these motherfuckers were armed and ready. You didn't get caught once. The police arrived on the scene just in time, thanks to Grandpa. Ah, he hurried back at home after the abrupt ending to Kate's phone call with him. When he arrived home, he realized that Kate was nowhere to be seen. He got a sinking gut feeling that the worst might have happened. He called the police instantly, and they made it just in time. The relief Grandpa felt after the news was like nothing else. What happened to everyone else involved? The man in the white van said that his reasoning for being outside Kate's home was because he saw a stranger following her home from the store. Of course, the police didn't believe him when they saw no one else was there. But when the news broke free about this, the police realized their mistake and that he had actually been telling the truth. He was released the same day. Liam's accomplice was never seen again after the incident. The psychopath who killed his ex-wife Ashley Liam and almost Kate ended up getting sentenced to life in prison. Kate is doing her best to recover from the incident, but it's difficult at night. She often hears those daunting knocks on her bedroom door, disrupting her attempts to sleep. Throughout every day, she finds herself checking behind and scanning every corner, consumed by fear and paranoia. Damn. Thanks for playing. A horror game made by 
solo developer Corv Corvin Corvin Rular. Thanks, Corvin Rular. This was pretty good. Huge thumbs up. This is a really good game. If you guys haven't played it, try it out. Pretty sure there's multiple endings, but I think I got the good ending. Um, I'll leave a link in the description below if you guys liked it. At the moment, this game is probably like three bucks. I'm not sure, four bucks. But um, it's really good. Definitely worth it. And, and yeah, if you guys watched this far, thank you so much. Really appreciate it. And please do hit that follow button or like or maybe not. But anyway, I'll see you guys again on the next horror session. Peace.